Hey guys, welcome back to another Joe Muller fast food review. Today I am doing Pizza Hut and it's Detroit style pizza back for a limited time and today I'm trying the Supremo exclusively for you. Up next, stay tuned. All right, guys, so I went to my local Pizza Hut in Hicksville, and I got the Detroit-style pizza back for a limited time, and check that out. That looks absolutely delicious, and quite frankly, I am kind of shocked at how small it is. Now, guys, do me a favor. Is it me? Or is this pizza from Pizza Hut pretty small? And are they getting smaller? Because if you look at this thing in relation to my cell phone, it's like one, two, it's like three cell phones. It is really not that big at all. All right, let me take you guys in for the much deserved and detailed Detroit style close-up. All righty, and here it is guys in all of its fine glory, back for a limited time at Pizza Hut, the Detroit style pizza, and I got the Supremo. It includes Italian sausage, green bell peppers, and onions. It smells absolutely delicious guys, and I'm gonna give this a shot and tell you exactly what I think. All right, guys, and this smells absolutely delicious. I have to go in here. And here it is. It is light, it is airy. This looks really, really good. And to chase it down, I have one of my favorites. I have Weiss beer. All right, here's a pretty big piece of onion here. Mmm. Nice and sweet. All right, salute. Mmm. Right off the bat, guys, you're getting the freshness of the, the pizza crust. It is really, really light. It is really airy. The sauce is really deep and tomatoey and rich. Mm. The peppers themselves are very, very sweet. The sausage is on point. Mm. This all works, guys. It is really, really good. I am so glad that Pizza Hut brought this back, actually. Now, we tried the Meat Lovers Detroit style. Check out the link below, and you will see what we thought of the Detroit style Meat Lovers. And once you do check this out, those videos out, I promise you, you will be running to Pizza Hut to get a pizza and try it. It's it's really really good i like the um i i think the star performer here guys is this the the dough is so nice and airy and light and fluffy mm. coupled with the toppings the green pepper is very sweet the onions are sweet mm. i think the one thing like I said at the opening, that really surprises me is how small these pizzas got. And that definitely is small. And I believe I paid $14.98 for this. Yeah. Edinger, Weiss beer, my all-time favorite. Erdinger, I should be able to pronounce that. Oh, yeah. Now, that's the icing on the cake right there, guys. Pizza and beer, there's no better combination, especially on a 
nice, cool fall day, football day. That's rock and roll. Mmm. This is really good. Pizza Hut, you still got it. Mmm. It is baked nicely. It is just going down real easy, guys. Mm. Mm. Well, it is absolutely fantastic, guys. On a scale of one to 10, with 10 being the very best, this is a Pizza Hut, knock it out of the park with a 9 plus all day. If you guys are lucky enough to live near a Pizza Hut, definitely check this one out. It is back for a reason, and people do like it. Now, one of the things that I'm noticing is that all the Pizza Huts around here on Long Island have closed. All the restaurants, all the Pizza Hut restaurants, this comes from a Pizza Hut Express. Basic, all they do is uh, delivery and takeout. No, there's no, um, you can't sit there and eat. Mm. This is definitely Supremo. All right, guys, from the home studio in Hicksville, that is a wrap. Definitely try this. You guys got the green light. Take care. God bless. So long. The sauce is nice and tomatoey. It's not sour. I like my sauce a little on the sweet side. This is perfect.